Handling a tarantula is a bit controversial topic, so let's talk about that. By now, I guess all of you know that I paired my female Brachypelma opilosum. I got male on a breeding loan, so that means that I get a tarantula for breeding and after the breeding I'm returning it to its owner and in case my tarantula makes a sec and if it's a successful sec half of the slings goes to the mature male owner usually it's 50 50 but it can be arranged so now after two pairings it is time to return this male so I'm going to take him out of this box and put it in a small container and I'm going to personally bring, bring it back to a friend that borrowed me this tarantula by now I guess you all know that I don't really handle my tarantulas, mostly because majority of my collection are an old world tarantulas. They are extremely fast, they can be extremely fast, and they got much much stronger venom than new world tarantulas. Venom that can put you in a hospital in some cases. So that is one of the reasons. Second reason is because in my point of view tarantulas are an observational pet. That means you have it and you observe it and you take care of it. They don't benefit from handling, they don't care if you handle, I mean they care, they, they want to get away from you if you try to handle them. So it is really unnecessary for them and it is done only for our own pleasure or thrill or whatever. Personally I am not totally against handling tarantulas. I'm I'm against handling an old world tarantula because it is really risk that is totally unnecessary and I see it only as a attention seeking act. But, but handling a tarantula really can provide some enjoyment for you because it is a thrilling experience to have a giant spider that got huge fangs and, and really it is an amazing creature to have it on your hand. I get that. I'm not against handling new world species that are docile. But I personally never took any of my New World Tarantulas out of its enclosure just for the sake of handling. I only handled two tarantulas. One is this male and the other one is my Gramostola Pulchra male that I had. And it was only during transfers. Just like I handled this one when I got it and when I took it out of the cup. That is just my opinion, it can be different than yours and that's okay. So now I'm going to show you what is the safest way of handling tarantula. First make sure that it's a new world tarantula because you don't want to get bitten by an old world. Second, you need to check the mood of your tarantula because for example you can see a ton of videos where people handle Gramostola rosea and they are super chill, you can even grab them or you can do anything they won't bite. But that doesn't guarantee that your Grammar Stola Rosea will also act the same. No guarantee. So always before you try to handle a tarantula, check its current mood. The best way is to take a kist, paintbrush, take this and gently rub its back legs. So as I am editing this video, I noticed that all the footage that I took with this camera is a time lapse. So I recorded it once again, but it won't be the same footage as with the GoPro, just so you know why it is not the same footage. It is hard to make videos. If the angel turns around and bites the brush then that could easily be your finger. As you can see this male is really calm. Now the best way after you see that it is all right place your hand in front and try to coax it on your hand and remember be gentle they are really gentle creatures they usually don't like the feel of human human hand because they know that that is something alive and usually they, they will try to move as soon as possible. He wants to get out. He doesn't appreciate me handling it. But let's convince him. Oh, 
Now you see, this is why you want to have your tarantula on your hand near the ground because if it jumps or runs like this one did, it won't fall from great height. One other thing, don't breathe in your tarantula or blow any air because they can react to it. And also in case, you see, he jumped. Remember that they can do that. I'll get him into the cup now. Also, in case you don't know, New World Tarantulas have second defense mechanism, or maybe that's the first for them. Anyway, on their abdomen, their ass, they have tiny hairs that they can flick with their back legs into the attackers, or in case they are startled, they will flick it onto you and those hairs are like tiny harpoons and they can cause great itch on your on your hand I mean your skin some people can have allergic reaction to the hairs and they can get a rash all over their skin the amount of irritation that their hairs can do also depends on the species some species are known to cause great irritation like Teraposa blandi or, or Styrmi let me just correct myself, it is pronounced Terrafosa Blondi. They are known for their size, but also in the hobby they are known for having a bad hairs that can cause real harm. And especially be careful to not get them in your eyes. For example, if you get hair on your hand, don't rub it on your eyes because they can cause a great damage then. That's it on the handling, I think I, I, think I said everything. With that done, I can now show you some updates. Abraham Baron asked me if I can show my diamond diadema a bit more. So of course that I can. I'm thinking maybe I can try to hand feed it. That would be super cool. Not really interested. I guess my hand is scaring it because the cockroach seems big, I guess. Now it's not time to groom myself. Oh. Just as he was drinking water. So there you have it, Abraham. Maybe I could do a time lapse with eating. Yeah, I will do that. Have you ever played with your tarantula? like this <laughs> someone is hungry she's even more crazy <laughs> see crazy girl and that's it for today's video i hope that it was entertaining and that you maybe learned something those are kind of my main goals to entertain and educate with that said thumbs up and comment i always answer the questions and also if you are new here make sure to subscribe you can click on that bell icon and that will send you a notification when i upload new video that way you won't miss anything that's it bye, -bye.